okay so the next type of uh, term where you understand before we move on we get to the rhyme scheme be asunas so when you rhyme with the words the words inside with the here vowel letters sound for inside then it be asunas for example the rain in Spain fall mainly on the plain. So you hear a a a sound. So whether you hear a a a sound, that be the a, or you hear e e e sound, that be the e, or you hear e e e sound, that be the i, or you hear u u u sound, that be the u. Then be vowels. Those letters be vowels. When you hear those those ones for your rhyme inside then it be asunas. So this is my rhyme, I rap from the beginning. My mind be racing every day, I'm lifting 45K of a 40 foot tarifa, poised with no delay. You hear the A, A, A sounds for inside. So that be asunas rhyme. So if like I write any other rhyme, where it be, it is sound like yeah, it still be as, uh, asunas rhyme because all these letters, it fall under the vowel sounds. Understood? Another rhyme be like, um, in the rain I gain strength and pain in this terrain. You know, like some DMX in line, you see, I cannot maintain the crashing of my brain. So all the vowel sounds, they make the, the lines they be. You get what I talk. Charlie, they rain for you, so permit me. Now, the, the next word where you for understand, right? It be alliteration. Alliteration be basically... Uh, when you rhyme, you write some rhyme, where the first letter, where you hear, it be a consonant letter or alphabet, then it be alliteration. A popular example be Peter Piper, picture of pickle pepper, right? So you hear P, 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 P sound. So when you hear rhyme like that, they do call them alliteration. Understood? Very good. So if the word is a consonant then you'll be cool then it be an alliteration so the first letter for any rhyme way that they call them alliteration rhyme it will be a consonant letter now if you be artist where you know these things before you even pen your lyrics you have all this knowledge around so when they do so uh, it they make the sound it the music they sound good because rhyme they inside the rhyme it mean they bring the art to the song it mean they bring the art to the song now the next Ten way for understand be syllable. When we talk syllable, syllable, it be like you see when you mention words, a word like banana, ba, na, na, right? Ba be one syllable, na be another syllable, na be another syllable. So in the word banana, there are three syllables. If you watch all the words in the world, they, they you go feel break them down to syllables. For example, convention. Con be one syllable, then be another syllable, shin be another syllable. So the word convention have three syllables. If you have this knowledge for your head inside, you go feel write some rhyme where you break down the words. Okay. So, like I talk, the word banana, the rhymes, the, sorry, the word banana, the, the syllables be three. So the word banana go feel rhyme with the word Canada. Yiribab came back straight from Canada. I'm eating my banana. So that'd be a, a syllable rhyme. Now, when we talk about this same rhyme, we talk about what do they call monosyllable rhyme. It'd be when the words, they sound the same in your ear. So, for example, the boy hit and they come sit. So the word hit and sit, there'll be mono rhyme because it be, you hear hit, hit, you know, be hitter, where it be two, right? It be hit, so it be monosyllable. So hit, sit, crib, blit, fish, it be monosyllable. Okay, now they get another one, that's my favorite. They call them multi syllable, or you will hear people they talk multi syllabic rhyme. MF Doom. Ferro Munch, Eminem, Tretch, 
Yeah. And I think for Ghana, this guy, Flow King Stone. Yeah, Flow King, they do a lot of multisyllabic rhyme. So the multisyllabic rhyme or multisyllable rhyme is one of my favorite rhymes. Now, this be when you have multiple syllables in a word. Okay, for example, you you have the word gratitude, right? And then the same word you go feel rhyme them with attitude. Okay, so let's say another one to be like, no way. Then you talk, no, I ain't coming. No way, cause you know today is a snow day. So no way, snow day. It be a multi-syllable rhyme. So another example be the sentence, two sentences. I've got bad taste. It gives me mad haste. So I've got bad taste. It gives me mad haste. Got bad taste. Gives me mad haste. That be multi-syllable rhyme. Look, some people know I'm crazy. I tell you no lie. Now it be the same multi-syllable rhyme way for Ghana. Did they call them bass on bass? <laughs> yeah, that be bass on bass. Unfortunately, most of our rhyme for Ghana here, that, that bass on bass sends no days. <laughs> We they do bars on bars, but sense no days. Huh? Make a pull up MF Doom in lyric right now. Uh, no, no, no. Make a pull up Ferry Munch. Uh, oh no. Very contagious rap should be trapped in cages through stages of whackness. First raps are blazing and it amazes. Me how you claim thug but go two ways but I scar tell pages. I'm in a lecture world. Pass more essays, the more case, police parades, the weeds, LA. So mo most of the time, Multi-syllabic rhyme, you they have the same sentence, but this word they rhyme even with the next word and rhyme with the other word and then rhyme with the other word before the last word for the end go rhyme. 